Meet the sulky over bulky Kinda hulky superhero A two-fisted and electrically transistor superhero An exotically neurotic And aquatic superhero The Marvel Superheroes have arrived! Okay, now into the battle. Now how the hell... Gee! Wonder how you beat him! Okay, so... Oh, okay, okay, okay. I was wondering. Oh, all right. So I just need to avoid that. Oh, uh, let's see. Okay, smashy, smashy. Shoot. Okay. Oh, okay. So it turns him into cement. I just gotta learn to avoid that. It can't be this easy, can it? There's gotta be something else I can do. All right, stun. Oh, sorry. The reticle was uh, blunt. Um. All right, so. That shoot, does shooting him help this, or I don't? Does it make him lose some health too? Uh, okay. So I do. I have to shoot him first, and then when he's done, attack him along with my friends. Bobby, the main thing to do. Okay. Um. Oh, by the way, uh, Spider-Man Three. I know everybody has their hateful thoughts and everything. It was. I thought it was okay. Spider-Man Three is okay. Um, okay, hit him with the ultimate attack. Um, it, I thought it was okay, but some of the villains, you know, again, uh, I think Sam Raimi has made it quite, you know, on point to say that he didn't want to put Venom, he just wanted to make New Goblin and Sandman the main villains only, and it was the studio that wanted to force Venom down our throats. Because again, they think he's popular and, you know, Movie companies think they know better. In reality, you know, I think Sam Raimi originally, from the beginning, he said he wanted just to use classic villains, which is fine. And you can tell that that movie was rushed to include Venom. Like, for one thing, how is it that both the 90s Spider Man, Spider Man the Animated Series on Fox Kids, and also Spectacular Spider Man, um, which originally aired on the Kids WB, it's funny that both versions of the Venom origin were a lot better than whatever origin Spider-Man 3 had. Where Spider-Man 3 had just the, 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 the rock uh, uh, meteor just crash into Earth and oh it already had Venom in it, it already had the symbiote. Like, no, that makes no sense. How is it that two versions of the, uh, the, the uh, two different cartoon iterations of Spider-Man had the same type of origin, which is what... Uh, uh, what is it? John, uh, J. Jameson, J. Jonah, Jonah Jameson's son, an astronaut, goes into space, you know, takes some, you know, space rocks or whatever, or in this case, uh, Amodium X, Exmodium X, whatever the heck they called it in the Spider Man cartoon. This is Promethium X, potentially the most powerful nuclear fuel in the world. Um, it, it was basically, he collects, you know, samples of a space rock goes back to Earth, the space rock goes awry, it becomes alive, it affects people, and then, you know, it, it has Spider-Man, you know, doing what he can to the crash landing, you know, um, spaceship, so it won't destroy New York, you know, and it somehow, you know, during the whole, you know, struggle of crash landing the spaceship safely on, on land, you know, it attaches itself to Spider-Man. Can I? Okay, so apparently this doesn't work on him on the villains thing. All right, so just use it on the bosses. Okay, got it. Um, like, how is it the two iterations had the same origin story for Venom, yet the movie just kind of did the half-ass thing, like, oh, a rock just fell on the floor and attached himself to Peter Parker. Whereas this, you know, the animated versions, the animated counterparts did a lot better explaining a lot, you know, with what's happening. Okay. Oh, there we go. You're beat. You beat the sandwich. <laughs> Level 7 complete. Alright, let right, let's see what's going on here. Oh no, he's forever a rock lord. <laughs> Yeah, uh, uh, GoBots, yeah, I know they came out first, but still Transformers had them trounce. Oh, we it's Willem Dafoe and his giant penis. 
Oh god, the story behind that in Antichrist. I don't know if you ever watched that Willem Dafoe movie Antichrist, but apparently his schwanz was so big they had to hire a stunt penis for the opening scene of that movie. I'm not going to splice in footage. But the fact that there's probably someone right now who his uh, resume reads, I was uh, Willem Dafoe's stunt dick in <laughs> Antichrist movie. A movie that had him, his penis nailed with hammers. Either way, oh god, I need to remove people from <laughs> these notifications. I need to update these notifications. Oh yeah, hu huge jack man. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. These character designs are great. Um, short hair. Yeah, the hero! Fucking Lockjaw! The best puppy. Best dog of the Marvel Universe. Not very detailed, but it's really cute. Thank you, Robert Downey Jr. Or imitation crab meat, uh, Robert Downey Jr. Wait a minute, that's not Nick Fury. He doesn't look like David Hasselhoff at all. I'll get that vampire's blood if I have to suck it from her neck. Okay, so I got Spider- Spooderman, you know, Chris Evans, Robert Downey Jr., I got uh, Mark Ruffalo, <laughs> I got Falcon, from Smash Brothers, I got uh, one of the Olsen twins, I got Scarlett Johansson, I got huge Jackman, I got Crystal Light, I was more of a Kool-Aid man myself. Um, alright, let's talk and get some dialogue going. You rocking that orange girl? He's an inhuman, orange hair, like me. I guess supposed to be red. And with the help I don't of Shield's tracking tech, he should be able to oh, hone in on hotspots and swap out our team members when things get rough. Isn't that right, good boy? When things get yes, rough. He is. gets super tough with a Hong Kong fui chop. Wah! All right, so this, let me just see if I can get familiarized Isn't myself. This outside some the Guardian's jurisdiction. Well, yeah. Well, I'm certainly glad but, um, hands. What the hell was I going on about? Oh, yeah, the mid, where, was it mid or late 90s uh, Marvel made-for-TV movies? Now, we all know the success of The Incredible Hulk, but, uh, and also, to a lesser extent, the live-action Spider-Man series, uh, that aired for CBS, um, which I think ran a couple episodes and had three movies. One was the origin movie, which I think was cut into two, ep uh, like two episodes of the first episode, two episodes. One that he went to Hong Kong, uh, I think. I, forget, I think there were only one or two. I forget. Uh, and I think the I guess CBS series that had um, uh, Darren Tate's uh, the, the, the 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 boss. You know the boss from Bewitched. Yes, I go that. I watch Bewitched. I watch, I watch these old shows because there was nothing on at times. It had Darren Tate's boss from Bewitched playing J. Jonah Jameson. And at that time, you know what? Solid casting. Um, let's see. Oh, oh, the f and also the fact that Peter Parker was played by a 30-year-old man even though he's supposed to be a college student. But again, you know, just like movies in the 80s where 40-year-olds uh, were pretending to be 16-year-olds. Hey, you know what? I'll, uh, I'll let it slide just because. Unlike you know the movie Sleepaway Camp, which at least had kids playing kids, which you know is okay. That's probably the only movie. Everything else is usually a 40-year-old trying to act like he's 16, but he's clearly 40, has a mortgage, and has like five kids and a dog. <laughs> um, but I, and there was also a pilot episode for Doctor Strange, which I swear to God, if you look that up, it looks like uh, John Holmes the the adult film legend, you know, playing, you know, Doctor Strange. Okay, so I guess that's the character switch uh, option. Let me talk to Spidey. Tom Holland. Um, and, you know, they try to get... You know, that one only lasted one... one. It was only a made-for-TV movie pilot, and I think it aired alongside the last episode of MASH, which is why it wasn't picked up. Um, of course, we know the success of the Incredible Hulk, Bill Bixby show. Awesome show. You know, great the ending theme also. 
Um, but the 90s, they tried, I guess, with the Marvel having the resurgence of some popularity, you know, and also, I think, about to head on to the whole bankruptcy uh, scenario, but let's not bring that up. But then again, that brought, you know, if it wasn't for that bankruptcy, they wouldn't have the movies that were made during the time. But then ultimately, they wouldn't also have the headache of buying back those licenses, you know, the licenses, so they can produce their own movies. Uh, okay. Ooh, okay. So, do I want anyone to change? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I get that. So, the big ego emblem is going to make me switch characters. Like, who do I want? Eh, okay. I can definitely see what I can do with this at the moment. Yeah, I don't need Groot. I can replace it with another powerhouse. Might Robert Downey Jr., get on board! What is this, 10 for 20%? Oh, okay, so it's like the previous two where if you put people that somehow fit that particular lineup or, I guess, clash with certain characters, you get like a bonus. Oh, come on! Let's see, who am I going to play Star Lord? You, you gotta get... Rep Queens represent! Forest Hill Queens represent! <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll definitely go with Spidey. Yeah, let's swing I, I need to. Yeah, let, let's go with it. Let's go with it. I can definitely level him up. Um, but uh, they uh, there's there was the um, Generation X, uh, made for TV movie, with you know Banshee played by a dude who was doing trying so hard to do like a Scottish accent, like it's so hilariously bad. Um. Let's see, there was also, again, like I mentioned before, the David Hasselhoff, Nick Fury movie, which wasn't overall that bad, but it was, again, you know, uh, definitely, again, these things you can set, tell that, okay, so that's how it works. Yeah, so if I create characters that are within that same thing, I get, like, certain bonuses. Okay. Um, okay, let me get back to David Hasselhoff for a minute. Uh, David Hasselhoff and his, you know, Nick Fury, again, wasn't that bad. Generation X was bad. Um, I think there was others. I know that um, CBS also... Like, again, these are on Fox. The Generation X. And uh, I think the Nick Fury movie was also part of Fox. Um, you know, filling up space until uh, to hopefully buy a series. Um, I know CBS had the live-action Justice League movie. Which I think the villain was the Weather Wizard. Uh, and it was bad. And it was funny, uh, especially the actor portraying... Okay, so that's what these stones are for. E easily leveling up. Okay, so let me see. Uh, okay. No, she's already level 7. Yeah, I need to level up my guys who aren't level 7 just in case I die. I need to catch up. Um, it, it, it's, uh, it's hilarious because if you ever watched that uh, CBS uh, Justice League movie... You can tell that they, they, I don't know what it was about. Well, for one thing, Martian Manhunter looked like Martian Manhunter, except he was fat. So the entire time he's being covered, overly covered, you know, in a giant cape to hide his, I guess, his fat. <laughs> um, and also the, the actual movie starts out like uh, one of the like MTV real world, like, uh, like camera like the actor is sat in front of a camera and they're just talking in a in a blank background like it's some weird MTV show uh, like they're doing like uh, revelations or something and talking about their thing and it definitely was the costumes were laughably okay they were bearable at least for the time being but you can definitely tell the difference between like like certain people <laughs> Like, like certain special effects and things like that, you know, from television to movies. Yep, that's Willem Dafoe riding his giant schwanz all over the sim all over the game. Okay, so it is like the previous one, just tap and hold, tap and hold. Okay, I think I'm good. Let's let, let's see who who what 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 I got what I got. Oh, let me first take care of these before I decide to know what the hell that is. Um, let's see. Smashy, smashy. Let's see. Let me get some blue balls here. It, no, that's not breakable because it, it, it's part of the background. What is this? Electro? 
That does not look like it is supposed to be there. Whatever that is, is that Electro? What is it? Some dangerous energy. Best to step Danger! Watch yourself. Show them what you got. Is this Electro? Or is this that Electro... Electrified villain that showed up on that episode of Spider-Man and His Amazing Friends? Become Video Man! That's better! It's not bad. Ooh, okay. Decent rewards for finishing it. Uh, definitely something I would mind doing right now. Oh! Fuck that! No, I, let me just continue on with my story. Let, 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 let me not. Yeah, let's continue on with the main story. Maybe I'll take care of it a, a grind to the side. You know, as a side thing to do. Uh, let's see, where am I? Okay, so this is just an open area before I enter, go back into the, the big house. The Maison Derriere. Uh, let's see. Okay, so here we go. Um... You know what? You know what show? You know what I want? You know, screw, you know, your your Hollywood remakes. Screw your, you know, like, like your uh, your prequel of certain movie franchises. You know, when it comes to comic books, stop remaking Batman so much. Spider-Man, okay, where well, he's back home, so he doesn't, you know, as long as, you know, Disney and Sony play nice, we'll hopefully stick with this. But, oh, never mind. I thought they had health behind them. Okay, so these are throwable items. Screw all these remakes. They should really remake movies that are horrible. Or you know what? Where's my Nightman cinematic universe? You heard me. Nightman. WPIX11 on weekends. Dude who flew at a weird angle and with one eye and played and he was a jazz singer at the night at in the daytime and a crime fighter at night. Any of you guys remember Nightman? Shit, I remember Nightman. But then again, I remember Nightman, the Beastmaster series, Conan the series, uh, Cleopatra 2525, uh, of course, Hercules, Xena, oh, Jack of All Trades, uh, Adventures of Briscoe County Jr., um, oh, and of course, fucking Mantis. You all remember Mantis, right? <laughs> Oh god, you know, where's 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 my uh late mid 90s superhero television, you know, <laughs> universe. Nightman and Mantis fighting crime in a future time. Uh let's oh, see. Worry, oh, what was this now? I have plenty more toys for you to play with. The prisoners have had Yes. The my giant Schwanz. Have you seen me in Antichrist? Oh, do you remember in me and Drag and uh, 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 Boondock Saints? I'm weird. Okay. What the? F Am I doing this wrong? Hold on. Let me, let's, let me try again. What the F? Maybe Spider-Man jumps higher? Okay, that doesn't help. My health sucks. Uh, game plan change. All right, let's see. Wolvie. So, is it? Yeah, okay. The, the computer can knows how to do it well, but yet my character is the one that has to struggle hard. At least Wolverine has the healing factor, which is a good thing. But at least I gain it back, which is okay. I just gotta time this crap. Uh, and jump, jump, Yeah, they're, they're okay, but I'm the one taking, you know, damage. Um, Yeah, where's my Nightman? Cinematic Universe. Okay, so they're in prison. Okay, so some of them are locked up, which means, hey, guess what? They'll pop out. Right? This one's for you, Morph. Oh my god, speaking of the X-Men cartoon. Oh god, that's literally all the things. Who? Come on, let's not be, on let's be honest. When you got the Disney app, it wasn't the movies and all that stuff. Who got it so they can watch all of those X-Men 90s Fox Kids cartoons? Come on. That was awesome. Especially, like, I think the one line that always sticks out on me was, uh, like, What did I ever do to you? You were born. Like, something for that, for a cartoon that age, you know, for that time, and even, again, for a kid's cartoon, you know, it, it, it definitely got away with, you know, it definitely was able to tell a lot of me messages of, you know, prejudice and things like that. 
which is why it appealed to uh, whoever, I forgot her name, who was the executive producer of the series, why she pushed so hard to have it, you know, uh, made into a cartoon, because she saw the potential and the storytelling on it, you know, to teach kids about that stuff, you know. Uh, of course, we don't have mutant powers, but we all have our own, you know, we, we all go through our own things that, you know, we need to learn, you know, prejudice, how hateful thing people can be. Um, but I'm not going to go into detail. Definitely awesome cartoon. Yes, there's some episodes. Uh, I think the... <laughs> Who are you? I'm the wild man of Borneo. Never understood what the hell that meant. But heck, it was the episode and it had cable in it. I don't give a crap. <laughs> of course, Days of the Future Past. You know, with uh, Bishop instead of uh, Kitty Pride. You know, certain things took it liberties. But, you know, whatever. Toad still told the story. Uh, and also Apocalypse, whoever wrote his dialogue, best dialogue of the, of the series, literally best villain dialogue you could ever think of. Oh god, what am I, oh, puzzle mazes over the top, oh god, how long will I be here? Let, let me count the ways, uh, okay, so, so one way open, one way out. What am I? What am I doing? Which way am I going? Okay, so I have to go to the top left. Oh God, this is gonna take forever. All right, let me. Let me. Oh, there we go. What? Is that it? Is that... No. Am I doing this right? I don't really know, cause I think. I'm... Am I trying? To... Sometimes I even impress myself. Nice work, team. Oh, okay. Thank God. I thought I was going to be there forever. I, I didn't... Like, I, didn't. <laughs> I don't want to be forever. Okay, so let's go. I the villains with the claws. I don't understand. I thought Wolverine was the only one and the best there is at what he does. And what he does, it ain't pretty nice. Okay, camera angles. Alright. Eh, still okay. Still bearable. Yeah. All right. Uh, okay, so we're having fun. I'm enjoying it. You know, repetitive. I like beat em ups. I don't care. Top down, whatever. Beat em ups, still good. Come on, team up. Robert Downey Jr. Come on, Tom Holland. Okay, that's done. Ooh, nice kick combo. Good combo, good combo. Who's healing up back? Okay. Let's let's beat up this Wolverine Weapon X wannabe. Okay, that it? Alright, there we go. I guess we can go to the next chapter. Anything around the corner, I think. No! Dead end. Um what the heck was I going? <laughs> I forget what the heck I'm talking about right now. Uh, let's see. Okay, so we got one dude here. Let's see if I can throw him. Get, get something thrown in. And there I go. <laughs> oh, I should try and just watch my health. Okay, I'm gonna... Okay, I better distance myself and then switch to somebody quickly. Do I have the time to switch? There we go. Alright. Okay, camera, please. There we go. Okay. Gotta learn that dodge button. Roll on, roll on, what? Red thirsting all the way here. Okay, so I got these big brawler types. Oh, uh, but oh, okay, definitely enjoying this. Um, what the heck was that? Nightman. I <laughs> like. Oh, I'm interested in playing. The, I'm distracting myself playing the game. Oh no. Why did I do that? I should have saved it for a boss. Wait, what the hell? Did War Machine just show up out of nowhere? What the hell was that? What, what was that? I, I, don't, I don't... What? I just saw... Was that War Machine? Oh, either way. Um... It's just... It's, it's hilarious. Let's see. Um... Nightman! <laughs> Cleopatra 2525. Beastmaster series. What the? I know I'm forgetting like a whole bunch of stuff. Of course we know, you know, the whole spiel 
um, you know, with Harsh Realm, Millennium. Anybody of you guys remember Millennium? Okay, so this ultimately also refills my health. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay, this is another boss. Who, who am I, who am I going to Should I switch? Should I? No, no, no. Let me just stick with who I have and see what I have. Oh, shit. Do I get to fight Willem Dafoe and his giant schwanz? Chaos Emerald, Chaos Control! You just throw a pumpkin? This entire facility will soon be under my control. I'll amass the greatest army of villains ever! And you will you know our first victims! <laughs> Alright, cool. Well, who, who, who am I fighting? Who, who, who did you. Oh, shit! Sweet! Classic comic Venom design. Awesome, awesome, awesome. None of that veiny Spider-Man 3. Again, I like Spider-Man 3. And Electro. Okay, definitely not bad upgrade to what his comic book look was. So, double boss fight? How, how am I supposed to do this? Pose for the camera, boys. Nice, I like the cell, the, the animated cell look. It helps. Uh... Okay, so I fight one. Stagger gone. Nah, I don't care for these uh, pumps. To okay, so I guess beat Electro first and then Venom will follow, or maybe the alternate? Oh, let's see what this okay. Now that I mastered the dodge attack, you're no you're not a problem. Nice. Slashy, slashy. Okay, so the symbiote, the Venom's goo, slows me down. Okay, that's not bad. Not bad. I should know I'm a teacher, club. Okay, master that dodge, dodge, dodge. Slash, slashy. You know what? Any of you, any of you guys actually remember Mantis? I know it's maybe. Oh, they. I think half the shows I just called out, people don't even remember. Or let alone know that these were shows. I know in my area they aired on WPIX 11 on weekends. You know, to fill, on those, fill out those time slots, you know, after cartoons ended. And, um. Because it was like. Saturday morning cartoons, a good chunk of them would start at 6 30 in the morning. You know, that's how I was able to watch. Ooh, does anybody remember Vampires? No? Do you know what Vampires is? Vampires was uh, like a similar, like, again, this was during the time when Power Rangers was successful. So there were a lot of shows that were trying to take that formula. But they weren't able to afford, like, to buy any tokuta tokutatsu or any, like, sentai rights. So they had to make with their own. So sometimes they would, like... You know, hire other actors to play the action parts while the main characters were all these nerdy geeks. Did, did he just Marvel vs. Capcom eat him? Or did he just spit him out? I, I didn't see. Did he just devour Electro? So Electro Venom, what am I doing here? Oh, thank you for that, Logan. Now, how the hell do I do? Is there a reason why that little thing on the floor is those electrical outlets okay, oh okay so what am I supposed to do am I supposed to turn it on no no attack well, it involves something okay but, but until I find out what the hell to do let's see it has to do with these things that's all I know does he have to just stand there no, that's not it. What the heck am I supposed to do here? I'm gonna... It's gonna kill me. Oh. Oh, he locks... Oh, okay, okay. Now I can continue talking about Nightman and... Okay, Vampires. Vampires. V-A-N, as in van, like a car. Uh, is basically like same Power Rangers situation. Um, live action segments where these kids in a band. And then it would turn into robot car vehicles that would play of course in a van who would live off of fuel that they would drink from other cars get it van hires 
again, it was, uh, they tried hard. You know, it's not as fondly remembered as uh, teenage samurai kids from from Beverly Hills. If any of you seen that super super, hold on, hold on, I have a copy of it right now. Actually. Where is, is it? Enough? Where is it? I know it's here. I know my pal Eddie here looks like a bad death metal cover band version of me. But there I'm we go. go. Yeah, it's tattooed teenage best. alien fighters from Beverly Hills. If any of you remember this series, 40 episodes of this. If you can track it down, my god. It's my god. It's like the most convoluted title, but also the most horrible costumes and monster designs this side of Halloween Adventure. <laughs> Oh god, okay, can I... Ooh, I got Venom! Good, 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 good. La, la, la. Can I switch him now? Uh, can I talk to you? Yes. Is there a problem? I like the voice. It ain't Hank Azaria, you know, Spider-Man, you know, animated series, but it's good. It has two voice, two voices kind of blend into one, so that's a good... That's already better than, um, what's his name, who voiced, who did him in Spider-Man 3. I forget. The dude from that 70s show. I don't forget. Topher Grace. There we go. Topher Grace. Hey, Scarlett Johansson. How are you? Are you are you excited for your movie, too? Um, yeah. So, Tattooed Teenage Alien Fighters from Beverly Hills. Again, Power Rangers formula. Just shittier costumes. And also, just I, I think it aired on USA Network during the whole Cartoon Express. I think it was around. I know Cartoon Express was around for a while, cause they aired, the, of course, the Street Fighter animated series. Yeah, I'm gonna definitely probably change, get get Venom. Um, they had the Street Fighter cartoon. God, that was horrible. Uh, they had the um, what else did they have? They had, uh, oh, the Savage Dragon. I believe they had SWAT Cats. Or, or, and, um, no, not SWAT Cats, Wild Cats. I'm sorry, Wild Cats. Covert Action Teams, which made no sense. But, again, that was the 90s comic book phase. Um, and, of course, it, you know, HBO had the much better Spawn series because, hey, guess what? It was adult, so they were able to actually just stick with the story and do what they could, while others were hampered with the whole kitty show thing, which I always found it weird that Spider that um you know Batman the animated series got away with a lot of stuff, while Spider Man you know was definitely you know it had its balls chopped off you would say like Spider Man like the Batman animated series had blood you know had you know good great violence it had gunplay it had guns shooting people people shooting guns and yet spider-man the animated series on the other hand spider-man did not throw one punch unless it was a robot or something mechanical he never hit any character um every even police officers who had guns suddenly didn't have guns they had like sonic tech or laser beams which was bizarre and like you know again it's still a great series definitely i, I love the spider-man animated series again second only to spectacular spider-man and that series was great but you know short-lived lasted only one season because you know it was during the whole um disney uh buyout so anything created outside of that had to be stopped because it wasn't going to get produced by disney um Thank you, Willem Dafoe, again for showing us you're still here. Um, let's see. And also, like Wolverine and the X Men was a great show, which again was canceled early because of what's going on here. Is it? Oh, Luke Cage canceled on Netflix. <laughs> you know, honestly, I think that the reason they're not saying anything, at least the actors are just keeping busy. Or just, you know, it wouldn't surprise me that eventually the series did come back into Disney Plus or whatever. Same actors, they're just waiting until whatever hoofah, ha hoofla, you know, has been going on with them. 
Oh, and um, if there are some um, vocal errors or if there's some, you know, um, recording errors coming up through my end, I do apologize. Again, I'm still trying to get used to this. So, you know, I'm used to recording maybe about 20, 30 minutes of stuff because that's pretty much all the dialogue I give out to, on my um, my uh, my video game music podcast, uh, Retro BGM Revival Hour. And for the most part, you know, my um, the Saturday morning breakfast mix, breakfast mix episodes, usually around the 20 minute mark. But, uh, oh, uh, uh, like I stated before, the Transformer script is completed. I just need to uh, give it a nice reread, you know, and uh, I should be into the recording phases like in a couple of days. And then it's just integrate that with the footage I captured, you know, and the cartoon footage I have. And hopefully, hopefully have it out soon, sooner than later. Uh, right now, from what it looks like, it's probably going to be the longest script I have and probably one of the longest episodes, but I will see. Oh, sweet Christmas! Where's your tiara? I want your tiara. <laughs> okay. Life filled. Do I go this way or the other way? I maybe I should go where Can we make at. this quick? Being in lockdown brings back some nasty memories. Okay. And Whatever, dude. From back in the day was up for parole. Heard he changed his ways, so I came to put in a good word at his hearing. Try to do the right thing and ended up trapped in jail. Story of my Ain't that just like life? <laughs> Alright, okay, so here's where I go. Either way. Um, where am I now? Where am I going? Another puzzle? Freedom! Horrible, horrible freedom! Finally! Oh my god! This, this wasn't. That was annoying. <laughs> Holy cow! That that definitely took a. That took years off my life. <laughs> Minutes into my. I don't know I'm playing. I don't know. It's taking a while. Oh, thank God! All right, let me just. Oh, big old door. Hopefully, there's like. Maybe do I fight William Defoe? Okay, Wolver, not that's not Wolverine. All right, let's see. <laughs> that's not Wolverine. All right, let's see. Where am I going now? This is another boss encounter. Oh, mm hmm. This definitely can be. What the hell? Let's see. Who am I fighting now? Let's see. Open the door. What's behind num door number A? Oh, sh oh, we got Spider Verse. Miles, Gwen, Miss Marvel. Are you serious? How many crazy superpowered prisoners does this stupid place hold? A lot. At last count, mm, six hundred and sixteen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Miss Marvel. Against three? Those are terrible odds. When this is over, remind me to never hang out in your dimension again, Miles. So she's just a dimensional hopping heroine. <laughs> Hey, all right. Let's see another slow mo fight sequence. Let's go. All right. So what do I got here? Got to fight all three at once. Okay. All right. So I fight the defenders. The new defenders. What, what, what is their group name now? Like you got the defenders. They sure as heck aren't the. Um, is it the defenders? The um. Where speedball is that? Where speedball? <laughs> uh. That's. The guard, the, the new, well, whatever. All right, so that's, all right, so Miles got beaten. I think. So I think Wolverine has healing factor. All right, so I beat one. Slashy, slashy. What do I got left? Oh, okay, that's it. Criminal Man, Spider Man. Wait, something's not right. Wait, here. Fog. Is this what you think it is? is any of this real? Whatever's happening, we can beat uh, it. Uh, 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 uh. It's it's. Yes, my 
It's the master of manipulation, the master of illusions. Mysterio. Fishbowl head. Alright, let's go. Why 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 is Gwen posing already? Okay. So beat the shit out of them and beat the sense into them. Well, at least they don't have that bad. Their, their health isn't that bad. But then again, they're young. The new warriors! That is, the new warriors. I'm sorry, there's so many goddamn team names that I keep forgetting. The, the new warriors. Oh god, okay. That's... Right? And a man team slashing. Go, let's go. One of them done? Okay, okay. Oh, okay, that didn't help me. Did it? I don't know. Dodgy, dodgy. It's elementium tasting time, boys. Alright, so she's done. Oh, okay. Okay, so he's keeping them away so they won't get affected by the gas, the fart gas of uh, Mysterio, the noxious fart gas of illusions. Alright, so she's almost done, Miss Marvel. Okay, so that. Woof. Do I fight the champ? The, the champions. I think that's the new group name. The champions? Is that their group? I forget. I, I don't know. Again, I, I, I had trouble just finding out what new, the new warriors with speedball. All right, there we go. Beat the, the illusionist wizard. Okay, so they lose more health when they're stunned. Okay, I need to make sure. Okay, that. He's almost done. It's a good thing I saved that uh, energy till the end. All right, Smashy, come on, come on, come on, let's do this. Going for that fart gas that he lets around. The mysterio fart gas. Okay, what are you doing? Powering up. Okay, so yeah, you are. No. Of course. Alright, come on, come on. We're, we're almost there, everyone. Get him punched in the face, okay. Almost, and you're done. That didn't even really take that long, did it? Oh, okay, so he's just gonna get away. Alright, fine, whatever. You can do your own thing, do your own thing. Okay, now they're... Okay, so, gas... The fart gas leaves with the fart owner? <laughs> Alright, so let's do this. So, are they part of my team? The new champions? The champions? Marvel champions? Breakfast of champions? You can never find a way to trust us again. Wait, is that Venom on your team? Duh. So, uh, I guess that means we're cool then, yeah? Womp, womp, womp. Okay, so we're good. Every generation needs heroes. We doing this or what? Hope you can use a big hand. Fisting. Big fist for fisting. So, what's new? Other than the fact that I totally just embarrassed myself in front of my idols. Well, I think that's pretty much about it right now. So, um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Again, there'll be other Let's Plays uh, coming up after this. Uh, you know, tell me if you would like to see more of these. Uh, if not, again, it's a, it's cool. Totally cool. Again, um, just, you know, take it easy, everyone. You know, take care of each other. Uh, and, you know, if you want to see more of this, comment below. You know, like, subscribe, you know, all that other shabazzle. Yeah. Um, again, this little, this is just a little side project, you know, to keep myself sane, but also just keep you guys occupied and busy, you know, distracting with whatever's going on. Um, till then, you guys take it easy, take care, and, um, you know, have a good one.
Bye.